Hey, welcome back to the Backwoods Gourmet. Today we're restoring an old cast iron Dutch oven, so y'all stay tuned. oven pot does not have legs so it'll work great on our propane burner so we just have a piece of copper pipe across here um, that's going to be our cathode okay and copper wire going down to our pots there's that, that are in the solution which we have a uh, soda ash in I don't know if you guys can see that but there's a lot of bubbles coming up that means this process is working Absolutely great. Um, that's right down to iron there. Uh, most of all the rest on the surface is gone. And let's look at the pot portion. Okay. It's doing really good too. The inside is uh, almost completely down to bare, bare cast iron. So let's take it over to the table and just rinse it off real quick. And then uh hit it with a little brush okay just a little work and we only used a plastic brush here not a uh, wire brush and that's looking really good um, I have discovered that this is not a matched pot you know, we see this gate mark on the lid here uh, I noticed there was no gate mark on the pot portion when I purchased it luckily I'm not trying to make a dime on this I believe this lid is probably 17th or 18th century, I mean uh, 17 or 1800s, not century, but the pot now that we've cleaned it up, you can see uh, the stamp on the bottom. It says a uh, 10 and a half inch Dutch oven made in Taiwan. Uh, probably still pretty old. I don't know what this uh, logo here it is, kind of a cross, and it says uh, WKH don't know what that means. Anybody does, let me know. Let me know in the comments. I think that's it. So here's the uh, the pot portion and that is in great shape. It's still nice and smooth. There's no pits on the inside. A few right here on the rim, which is not a biggie. Uh, the outside is in pretty great shape too. So we're going to go ahead and just let it dry for a little while. I'm going to wipe it down with some oil. And uh, we're going to put a season on it, but it cleaned up really nice in that e-tank uh, electrolysis bath um, and it was really easy and over here in the gas grill we've already got seasoning rolling on that old Dutch oven uh, 
Alright, it's about the third round on the old uh, on the old guys there. You don't know how old really. Just wipe them with another coat as they're cooling down. You see that pot's uh, got a nice thing on there now. Looks a lot different than it did a little while ago, that's for sure. It was all still leave the rust on it. There's the lid. It's got a little amberness to it, but you know that's gonna that's gonna get better over time. Monterey, Nuevo Leon, Mexico. And uh you see that handle there. That looks like it was forge welded together. Pretty old. This part? Mm, probably not. But it's going to cook great. That's pretty good for a rusty old piece of junk. Thanks for watching the Backwoods Gourmet. As always, please subscribe, share, comment. Hey, if you like what we're doing, hit that like button. And we'll see you next time.